Hi everyone. I look for a lot of the different secrets and mysteries from all around the world, looking for the coming of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, Emmanuel, the Son of God, who was risen from the dead and took all the sins of the world away. Now the world elite, the Illuminati, the Freemasons, and even the spiritual realms that are all around us, they leave their signs and secrets right in front of us in symbolism. And on our channel, we bring all this back to the Word of God, and we show how we're nearing the end of days. We are nearing this time in the Bible now of Revelation 13 and Revelation 13. This, this is basically all of the end times coming, all the four horsemen and everything. But in Revelation 12 and 13, the dragon is coming after this woman, and she has granted the wings of a great eagle, and there will be a worldwide shattering earthquake. And the earth helped the woman, and the earth opened her mouth and swallowed up the flood, which the dragon cast out of his mouth. This is shown to us over and over again as we show the whole earth is going along as a stage, a big matrix as God brings about the end times. You have to have faith in him as all of this comes about. Every single bit of the Bible will be fulfilled. Even the part here for Michael and his angels fight the dragon, and that great dragon was cast out, that old serpent, called the devil and Satan, which deceiveth the whole world. He was cast out unto the earth, and his angels were cast out with him. And I heard a loud voice saying in heaven, Now is come salvation. That's when that great earthquake happens. And the strength of the kingdom of our God, and the power of his Christ. This is Satan right here. For the accuser of our brethren is cast, cast down, which accused them before our God day and night. And they overcame him by the blood of the Lamb, and by the word of their testimony, and loved not their lives unto the death. Therefore rejoice ye heavens, and ye that dwell in them. Woe to the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea, for the devil is come down unto you, having great wrath, because he knoweth that he hath but a short time. This is replayed over and over again. When the devil comes, it's the end of the time of the blue. Literally. Just as with LeBron James, number 23, who betrayed everybody in Cleveland and left and then came back. This is one more symbol of the Red Horseman coming to bring war, and he's known as the Accuser. Watch this brand new commercial right here. Oh, don't worry about it. They can't hear me. I'm just in your head. See, he's in his head. But watch. He is going to accuse him. Woo! Oh, don't worry about it. They can't hear me. I'm just in your head. No, my angles. He's not studying over here. Mr. Angles. He's not studying over here. Mr. Angles. He's not studying over here. Did you see him accuse him? Did you see he accused him? and got him in trouble. The accuser is coming. That's what is shown over and over again. The betrayer, the Judas, is coming, the dragon. This is shown over and over again. It was shown in Django Unchained. Django represented Satan being set free and coming with his great wrath. And he's coming with the Germans. This guy is a German. It's shown right here on the cover of these magazines. Obama as your Django Unchained. And you see he's working right with Germany. And this is called the Feet of a Bear, the Revelation 13 beast that comes after this woman with this great earthquake. Here is your Django Unchained right there. The Red Horseman brings war, and the Green Horseman is death. Do you see the symbol right in front of us? So let's show this, that LeBron James is shown as this, and that's been his career. Whatever you want to say about him, everybody's used as a puppet around here. I work with the Holy Ghost and God. So let's keep on going. This is Washington, D.C. We keep watch around the 15th through the 23rd of each month, just like LeBron James' number is 23. Here is the White House, and it shows right here, You see there's even a goal post right there? Look at that. Do you see it? That's the large CERN Hadron Collider. And when the nuclear football is kicked, and when the little horn receives its grievous head wound, 
Over here is the woman that is caught away, even as this large fire begins. See that there? And it's all on the 15th Street. And that is the time when our Constitution will break. We don't know about dates. We keep watch from the 15th through the 23rd. See the 23, just like LeBron James' number? And the 50 for the 5th angel and the 5th age coming of judgment. And you can see that that is when the little horn comes down. Do you see him right there? God have mercy on us all. And then you can see right here, this represents the simian flu being released. Now this is how it goes. This is the throne of the world. See the 23rd? 15th through the 23rd. This is the throne of the world. When Jesus Christ comes, he will sit here. And then he will cast down the left hand. Remember, as Jesus is looking at us, this is the right hand. The right hand goes to heaven. See the woman? When this football is kicked, the wise virgins go to heaven. On the left hand, the accuser is cast down. Number 23, this guy right here in red coming, and this nuclear event will start World War III and break our constitution and such, and allow all of these guys to rise up with Django unchained. And there's a big thing about him coming after the white people too, everybody. Get ready. Something's going on here. There's a big racial thing going on between Satan and actually the white race. Yes, it's huge. This guy in this movie said he hates white people and he's going to kill them all. That's what he says in this movie. And this is the same guy that played the president. Yes, he has played the black president. Here he is working with Nazi Germany. This guy is a German coming to kill and destroy the USA in this movie. Literally. And it's all meant to happen. You can't stop this. This is even called the victory of the Lamb when this all begins. He has a short time. So do you see that right there? Number 23, coming down. The accuser of all of our brethren. You can't get away with that. Mr. Ingalls, he's not studying over here. Mr. Ingalls, he's not studying over here. Mr. Ingalls, he's not studying over here. He just accused him. Do not forget, what is Satan? The accuser of our brethren is cast down. And then he goes after the blues, exactly as LeBron James beat the Golden State Warriors. He beat the blue team because he has but a short time. And then he's even in people's heads. I'm just in head. You hear that? He's inside of the people now, accusing them. This is the end times coming, the red horseman that brings war. May God have mercy on us all. So now you know more. The 23rd, he comes down. Here, let's show it on this other glyph where you'll get a better view of this. Let's show it on this ancient one. Show you how real this is. This is one of one of at least 20 to 50 different hieroglyphs we've broken down from around the world. God created all the universe. Everything comes back to God. This is from Egypt of Akhenaten. Remember, from Abraham to Jesus went to Egypt. Moses was taken out from underneath the burdens of Egypt. We have to escape from under the burdens of Egypt again. Do you see this clown coming down with the V for the fifth age? and the key to open the abyss. And then there is the red bull, the red horse of war coming. This is the dog star Sirius, part of God's throne and the star of Bethlehem. That's what this represents right here. Sitting on top of this. Sitting on top of that. This is the left hand, the accuser coming down. LeBron James right there. At the same time, in the right hand, where Jesus Christ sits in the power of God, that's when the eagle leaves for the woman and the great earthquake. The mask comes off Obama at that point. And do you see now the eagle goes to the top, way up here. And now Jesus sits on top with the woman 
and turns this wheel of the Great Tribulation. And here is the accuser, the Satan guy with the frogs coming out of his mouth, the false prophet. See how they are chasing him. And there is even the mark of the beast. It's all going right by scripture. God's not going to stop this. He's getting it all set up for the end times. So that's why we keep watch from the 15th. See, this is 15th Street. 15th Street through the 23rd. We don't know what time or what date something will happen, but let's keep watch. It's the 50, the fifth angel that comes with the key to open the abyss. And the locusts are set out. World War III begins and such. All of these people are coming with this great earthquake. Something could even happen to Obama. We don't know. So let's keep watch. And I'll leave you with this commercial where LeBron James is the accuser. Angles. He's not studying over here. He is accusing him. This is the very basics of the Bible. Confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead. And you'll be saved. Hallelujah. The accuser is coming. And he will have but a short time to trick the world and go after all the blues. God have mercy. Mr. Ingles, he's not studying it over here. He's streaming my games. You can't get away with that. Woo! Oh, don't worry about it. They can't hear me. I'm just in your head. No matter how you use your data, Verizon's got your back. Introducing the new Verizon plan. Now get 30% more data, no surprise overages, and keep the data you don't use. All on America's best network. Why settle when you can have everything? Switch to Verizon now. Mr. Ingles, he's not studying over here. He's streaming my games.